Okay, on another road trip today. And we're on the line of the uh, town line of Border and Oxford County. And we'll try to show you the other side of the sign. Hopefully it'll show up if I can get out of the sun. And that's Parsons Field, York County. Or Keyser Falls, as the locals call it. And that's Keyser Falls Village. And I thought I'd stop and get a little video of the Keyser Falls. Now they do have a hydro plant over there. This one thinking is probably over capacity and it diverting some of the water over these falls. You see there's a number of different falls here. Uh, you can see down there there's also some water being diverted but not the hydro temperature. There's like quite a bit of rain. I think most of the snow is melted. There is still some inkling of snow here and there. I don't know if you can hear that. I'll try to speak up a little bit because it's probably going to drown me out. I typically don't talk too loud in these videos, but in this instance, I will try to speak up. The river's got quite a flow to it today. I'm going to go on the other side of the bridge as well. There's no sidewalk over there, but I think I can stand over there safely enough to uh, at least get some video of it. Maybe I'll tie this in with uh, the Sumscott River, which they're taking down the Dam in the Sumscott River, which is in Westwood. So that flows pretty good now. So here we are, um, Route 160 and 25. We'll wait for a few of these cars to get by. Not sure why there are so many cars, but again, in this time of uh, stay at home. I'm out. I guess there's a few other people out. And that's on the other side of the street. Like I said I might try to go over there and I've got a pretty good zoom on this camera but I would like to walk across the bridge on this side just to show you what's going on. Hopefully you won't see a video of me getting hit by a car. <laughs> and, and I just saw that. flood stage, but I know some of the rivers were running up flood stage the other day because of the rain. There's a lot of water diversion going on here. <coughs> Don't mind the cough, it's just my allergies acting up this morning. Sure, how that house, how people get to it. I never really noticed it before. Must be a little bridge across the dam over there, so people can get to their house. There's some controls for uh, raising and lowering. 
opening up the valves underneath, I guess, that's what that would be for. Again, it's a little noisy right here where the falls are. It is uh, big enough for a car to drive over. So you can live on your own little island, surrounded by water. Look close enough where you might get flooded out. They don't open up the spillway and down. And that looks like a community park over there. Never noticed that before either. I've come through this area quite a bit. Done a fair amount of business in uh, Giza Falls, Parsons Field, Porter area. Again, a little, little better view of the falls here. Picnic tables. You can have your lunch and enjoy the serenity of this beautiful spot in Giza Falls border. All right, that's it. Enjoy your day. Please like and subscribe. Also, if you see that little bell, if you click on that, that will alert you every time I load up another video. I guess the logging people are still working. All right. Later. And here we are still on the bridge. Thought I would just uh, show how the water flows down to the hydro plant. mill. I'm not sure what they did in this mill, but like uh, most mills in Maine, they've uh, closed it up and it's been vacant for years. It would be nice to see somebody take that over. It would be a beautiful place for, I think, for condos or maybe a retirement home. People could be up there and see the river and Relax for me. As uh, Old Lincoln moves himself. Alright. See ya. So, again, the mill. I'm not sure how much of that came out before. I couldn't see anything because I was in the sun. Hydro plant. And the waterway. And one of these days I'll do a little video of downtown Keys of Falls. I do on a Porter, but there's nothing there. Everything is closed down in Porter. There is a laundromat for sale if anybody's interested. Other than that, there used to be a store. That's no longer going, but, but Keys of Falls does have a hardware store. It's an Asian restaurant, which is pretty good. I think that's Chinese food and uh, an insurance company. Oh, and uh, an antique shop on the edge of town, which I think is still open when I went by. It said open every day. <laughs> All right. Ciao.